All right, welcome back everybody. So since we completed the Winchester uh, series, we're going to move on to a couple more lever guns that I happen to have um, in the collection. Uh, these are uh, both modern firearms. Um, this one is a Henry, of course, as you saw. Uh, known as the, well, the model H001T. Uh, this one is not stock completely and as you can see as we bring it forward so you can see it's got some pretty nice wood in it this is actually their premium stock set that they offer and you can buy these to to dress up your your little Henry if you would like to is it worth it uh, you be the judge I think it's quite pretty it also has a golden boy band on it but uh, capable of shooting 22 shorts long and long rifle so we can see right there now these Henry's don't have anything to do with the original Henry's uh, I point that out because uh, if you think you're buying an original Henry when you buy a Henry you're not uh, they are still an American company and nothing against the company at all. Their service that I've had was very good. When I got this stock set, I was a little disappointed in the figure on it. Even though it's not bad, it's not as good as I thought it should have been for the price you pay for them. But my original stock was damaged, which is the reason I decided to go with this premium stock set. So you can be the judge on that if it's worth it or not to you. It's it's not bad, but it's not absolutely spectacular. It's about a mid grade set I would put it at. I've seen I've got guns that are a lot prettier than this, but it's it's kind of fun. The great plinker rifles. You see, I got the the leather wrap I put on these. I I order some of them. I build some of them. This might be one I ordered online. You can buy them pretty cheap, and uh, but they're also easy to to make yourself if you have a little bit of leather work knowledge. Doesn't take a lot. Again, these have been checked. They are empty. I always do that before every firearm video I make, even the unboxing videos. I either have my FFL check them or I check them. And then rebox them and unbox them for you. This is show business after all, right? You can see the ramp sight. It does have a brass bead front sight. Common to many uh, of my lever guns have we seen. This has an exceptionally smooth action. Exceptionally smooth. Uh, no safety on them, which is nice. A half cock position and full cock very much traditional in its operation which I really appreciate on these firearms and to, again to say there's nothing wrong with the Henry name uh, they build their own firearms unlike the unmentionable places we have like well I'll mention at Springfield Armory which is which I don't allow in my house anymore but they are just strictly an importer, much like, uh, well, maybe Cimarron Firearms would be a better example. They don't actually build their own guns, but Henry does, and they own the Henry name now, and they build their own guns in a quality company, but it is not an original Henry. They do make reproductions of original Henrys, but they are not original Henry's. But it's about as close as you can come unless you want to spend an absolute fortune on purchasing a, an original Henry from the pre-Winchester era. Well, there we go. Just a real quick look. Um, so you can see the premium wood on these little 22's for fun. Real handy, fun plinkers excellent for uh, learning your uh, shooting don't worry it's unloaded just pointing it at the camera I won't harm you in any way well, there we go thanks a lot for watching notice I didn't drop the hammer on a rimfire I just 
won't do that unless it's a Ruger. A little Henry nameplate on the buttstock. All right, thanks for watching, and we got one more lever gun to go in this continuing Winchester lever gun type series, and uh, we'll dig that one out next and take a look at it. Thanks for watching.